Maria here with Lars Christensen, who plays the role of the leader in the film Watcher. Welcome. Congratulations on the screening. Thank you. Could you tell us a little bit about your role and the film The Watcher so that we get a sense of the storyline? Well, it's a um, sci-fi, um, uh, what are they called, adventure kind of thing set in, um, in a different time, not our time. Mm -hmm. And um, it's about two groups of people, uh, survivors, mm -hmm. uh, the Seekers and the Watchers. Okay. And I play the leader of the Seekers and um, opposite Kate, who plays one of the Watchers. Mm -hmm. um, her and I have a history together. Um, and you say it's more like a rivalry, or is it that you're after no, the same thing? To be um, a female slave um, in in my tribe. So, um, and the piece uh, that we've been filming uh, is where they meet again after several years apart. There, there is a fight between them. Mm -hmm. My character is looking for the for girls. Uh, that we take um, to fertilize and she is the one who is taking them away from us uh, trying to take them away and protect them and lead them to her encampment so that sounds fascinating yeah. and um, I know that there's a lot of special effects involved and and various extensive fight scenes as well yeah could you tell us some of your kind of maybe worst experiences or best experiences, no, whichever. Apart from her trying to break my nose several times and kicking the living hell out of me. Yes, apart from that. Yeah, that's the good part. <laughs> <laughs> okay, understood. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about uh, your experience with acting in general and, and what primarily do you do? Is it mostly independent film or theater? Yeah, or? Yeah, it's been uh, absolutely primarily independent movies uh, till, you know. Next time, so. <laughs> and how long have you been doing this? Um, about six, seven years now, I think it is. Yeah. And where, so, where are you from? Because I'm detecting a subtle accent. Is yeah, that is that okay if I ask that? A subtle accent? Yes, I'm Danish. Oh, wow. Yeah, from Denmark. Wow. Yeah. What brought you to America? Do you mind my if wife. I ask? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, yeah, my wife. Yeah. So nothing to do with acting, or the acting was just sort of. Did you used to do that in Denmark as well, or did you mostly get into it in America? Well, I, I've done some back home, uh, mostly uh, theater and um, amateur theater, and I did some theater when I came over here. Uh, but it was a childhood dream of mine uh, to do movies. Um, and then um, they were making a movie up in uh, Bethel, Maine, um, and it was a... Um, Oscar-winning director. It was a movie called 12 Dogs of Christmas. It was a children's movie. And I went up there just to, for the hell of it to see what it was. And they they hired me on and uh, as a stand-in. And so I stayed on the whole uh, movie. And yeah. so I got to learn how it is yeah. and all that. And it was brilliant. I loved it. And then I you know, decided to pursue it. Yeah. Awesome. Well, congratulations. Congratulations on everything you've just said, but also, could you share with us what you have coming up next? No, I can't. It's a secret. <laughs> okay, well, that's fair. I don't fair. really know yet. <laughs> I've just been home for a while. Mm -hmm. I've just been home uh, in my home country, you know, for a couple of months to take care of my family and friends there. So, I just returned, actually, this the 28th, so... Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for stopping by, sharing your experiences. It was lovely to meet you, and we'll be seeing a lot more of you, I'm sure. Best of luck with all of your endeavors in 2014. Thank you. Thank Take you care. very much.